Ryler DeHart is ranked in the top 20 in the world pickleball rankings. His wife, Megan Fudge, she's in the top 10. Once college sweethearts, they're now the perfect pro pickleball pair. Hi, you better bring it. Hey. No. Ryler and Megan met at the University of ah. Illinois, both tennis players, but they didn't meet on the court. So we met playing pool at a bar. <laughs> Megan was recruited from Germany while Ryler was chasing his dreams on the pro tour. Yeah, as a pro, probably playing, well, definitely playing Rafa Nadal on center court at the US Open. After six years, injuries derailed this Jesuit high school grad's tennis career. He may have put down the racket, but together they picked up the paddles. During COVID, and we saw people playing pickleball on YouTube and on social media and so we were just like what is this sport you know and so we we chalked up a court in our driveway when we were living in orlando and started playing people kept talking about pickleball and we're like we're not old enough to play pickleball right i mean like we're not we're not retirees oh oh from the driveway to the association of pickleball professionals tour the app this pair from bel-air is winning and meddling in events all over the country. We all last year we played together, um, which was super fun. And then uh, this year we've, <laughs> he's gonna say I decided, but we decided that we were gonna separate, go separate ways um, and uh, have a pickleball breakup. <laughs> yeah, she broke up with me. <laughs> Who's got the keys? That's always the number one question. They don't get too far away from each other because the family now lives in their house on wheels. We've chosen the RV because of pickleball life, because we get to travel around the country, going out to California. We've got Georgia coming up. We create stability for our kids so they feel like we have, you know, our home base with us. A journey they enjoy together. Three years later that we've embraced the sport that's given us like a second life at being a pro athlete again. In Tampa, Kyla Berger, ABC Action News.